Hello, this is Chris from virginusers.com. Today we have our Motorola Triumph, which we've already rooted, and if you look at our other videos, you'll be able to find that video. And we were trying to tether it to a computer. Uh, we went first to Wi-Fi Tether. It's usually our application of choice, and we actually had some problems uh, with it. Our computer wasn't getting an IP address. Now, to use any of these, you will have to be rooted. Let's start that connection real quick and show you what we're talking about. Connect to Android Tether. And if we look, we never seem to get an IP address. This uh, netbook is run Windows XP. Basically, it'll keep saying acquire network address, and then when it says that that's completed and it's connected, we don't have an IP address. So let's go ahead and stop this. We've tried the beta, and we tried version 2.0.7 also. So then we tried Barnacle, which is available in the Android market. Uh, we'll post links to all this information and step-by-step -step what we did. Let's start that. It's going to say there's an argument, and the first time you actually start it, it's going to say that it wasn't able to set MTU, and then it can change the settings for you and restart it. So it changes the settings, and you start it again, and it doesn't give you uh, the error that doesn't allow it to start up the second time. So now it says running, so if we refresh our uh, network list, we should be able to see a an SSID called Barnacle. We're going to go ahead and connect to that. Now the first time we connected to this, um, it loaded up Google, but some of the more intensive, larger websites, uh, it was just timing out on those. Here you can see we're connected. What we did was we used a program to change the MTU. Um, if you just Google programs to do this, you might get speedguide.net and they have a bunch of downloads here. We used the first one, it was uh, SG TCP Optimizer and they make them for uh, different operating systems also so just try those out. But basically what you're going to do is go into the program Let's see if we can find it. it says we're connected to Barnacle This is the site that we found it on. So here's the 2.03 version. We'll just run it again. I believe this executable is actual the actual program and not like an install file, so we might have not saved it. This is downloading on a uh, Virgin's network, also known as Sprint's network. Click run, and this program opens up. And we went to the network adapter for our wireless card. And in the beginning, everything will be grayed out. We hit custom settings. We changed this to 1472 and we actually brought this down to 1.5 uh, megabits per second and it modified the TCP uh, receive window then we hit apply changes it let us know that we might have to reset the device uh, for the actual changes uh, to come into effect so we went ahead and rebooted and as you can see now we can go on speedtest.net we'll do another speed test for you on this bottom left corner you can see right here where it says Sprint PCS Now if you think these are slow speeds, they are in fact pretty slow, but 
we're in an apartment and there's not a very good signal here. That's not actually our location. We are in Austin. I know this account is uh, not throttled. We have definitely not passed 2.5 gigabit uh, bytes this month. So if you want to find out exactly how we did this, please visit SprintUsers.com. Also, uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can see the latest things we're working on.